You think one of these people is a terrorist? ABC and Lexus bring you The Takedown, a unique virtual reality experience that takes you inside the world of Quantico. Join us as we take a special look behind the scenes. What's so cool about this particular project is that the viewer gets to kind of step inside the Quantico world and gets to be in a scene with us, which is exciting for us too, because we love our viewers. We have Lexus coming together with ABC for the show Quantico, and it's just been great. It's the it's, uh, first time that I've seen uh, a script come across my desk that really makes use of the VR technology, really pushes it forward. Our fans can literally be there in our world with us as a character, and that's super unique. Two things that I really love about VR. The first one is just the initial immersion of it is, is always hits you, the fact that you can look around and you have that kind of wow moment. Remember, look everywhere. But I think the second thing for me was, how does this now translate to, to telling stories? How can we do things differently? We've got to a situation now where we can put a VR camera in pretty much any place and I think mo most importantly, um, move that camera around. You have to do something that you're taught never to do in TV and film and that is look directly into the camera, which feels a bit uncomfortable, but in virtual reality, the camera is a character. You don't want too much going around you in 360, it's story-wise. You want the story to be playing out in a, in a certain sort of space, and then you want things that you can also look at and engage with around you, but you don't want that story to be literally happening in 360. It's sort of like theater. The whole stage is set, and you have to go through the whole process from beginning to the end. There's no messing up, there's no forgetting a line. If you forget a line, you start from the very beginning of the whole project. The camera's so cool because the cameraman actually wears it on his head, so he comes in, uh, we're, we're in a car, and he comes in the car with a helmet on, and it looks like a little soccer ball on top with all these cameras attached to it. It's obviously a helmet cam, um, and this, this sits on a person's head, or you can be mounted on a backpack or held in the hand. Um, and it allows you to have a, a POV experience. We've seen stuff where you can just sit in the car and look around while it's having a test drive, but they've really taken it a step further here with a, a proper narrative, and I think that's done uh, through the vessel of the Quantico, so it works fantastically. To see the entire Quantico virtual reality experience, visit QuanticoVR.com. When Quantico returns March 6th, we pick up right where we left off. The command center blew up because there's a bomb in the command center. At this point, we don't know who's alive or who's dead, so those questions are going to be answered. And we also have another time jump. We jump a little bit further into the future. The rest of the season is so exciting. We can't wait for you to see it.